All right, guys, really, really quick one. This is going to be a no frills video. So, if you, like me, have got a VW T5 or a T6 and you need a rear view mirror because you have got a van, you've taken out the bulkhead like I have, so there's a big gap now at the back, then you'll have probably this little stumpy thing that you can see there. And so, what I've done, I've bought myself a rear view mirror and I'll just quickly show you how you go about fitting this. Chances are you've got one of these, a little blanking plug. Now, the best way to get this off is to get yourself a little trim tool. And literally, if you just push that around the back and prise it off, there you go. That little cover comes off. And then you'll see on here, on the back of the mirror, there's this clip. And you can see that that just lines up on the back there. So what you do, you get this, you offer it up to it. If you give it a little push, you'll feel it push on. Then you just twist the stem round. That's it, and you'll feel it click. And there we go. Wing mirror is on. Brilliant. So there we go, guys. I promised it'll be a quick one. That is now on. It's got the little bit at the bottom to sort that out. Just give it a little polish to get rid of the hand marks. So there we go, guys. If you've enjoyed that video, link in the description to the trim tool set and also to the rear view mirror. I got it off of eBay, it's about six quid. As you can see, I've taken the blue stripe off the side of the van. A little video that's going to follow shortly of the pop top being installed by the Dub Hut fitting an Oz Top through for me. So that's going to be awesome. Guys, if you've liked this video, please do give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.